On January 10th, the Biden administration announced that it is requiring health insurance companies and group health plans to cover the cost of over-the-counter at-home COVID tests. This is part of an ongoing effort to expand access to free COVID testing across the United States. The new requirement takes effect January 15th, and it applies to those over-the-counter tests that are FDA authorized, cleared, or approved. This means that most consumers with private health coverage can go online to a pharmacy or to a store, buy a test, and either get it paid for upfront by their health plan or get reimbursed for the cost of that test by submitting a claim to their plan. The requirement actually incentivizes insurers to cover these costs upfront. There is a limit to how many tests per month an individual can get covered under their health plan, and it's eight tests per individual per month. There is no limit if the test is ordered or administered by a healthcare provider following an individualized clinical assessment. So that might be someone with underlying medical conditions is ordered to get these tests by their physician that would be covered with no limit to how many of those tests were prescribed. Now, if you have Medicaid or Medicare coverage, we're gonna look at what the requirement is for those programs, because thus far we've been talking about private health insurance. If you have Medicaid coverage, state Medicaid and children's health insurance programs are already required to cover FDA authorized at home COVID tests without cost sharing. So for free, guidance issued back in 2021 explains that all types of FDA authorized COVID tests are covered without cost sharing under the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services interpretation of the American Rescue Plan Act. Now let's say you have Medicare. Medicare pays for COVID diagnostic tests performed by laboratory, such as a PCR and an antigen test. There is no beneficiary cost sharing when the test is ordered by a physician, non-physician practitioner, pharmacist, or other authorized healthcare professional. Now, if you have a Medicare Advantage plan, you should check with your plan to see what kind of coverage they have for the at-home over-the-counter COVID tests. The guidance comes to us from the Departments of Health and Human Services labor and treasury and it takes effect like we said january 15th 2022 but it may take a little time for supply to catch up with demand for insurers to arrange for tests and for some insurance plans to come up with their reimbursement steps this guidance also ends when the declared public health emergency ends with the recent surge in cases, time is of the essence, however, and there are other programs in the works to try to get more testing into the hands of more people. This coverage requirement is only one piece of the puzzle. The U.S. Department of Health and Human Services tells us that they are providing 50 million free at-home tests to community health centers and Medicare-certified health clinics. These tests are for distribution at no cost to patients, or to community members. And also the feds tell us coming soon, a federal website where you can request a free at-home test by a home delivery. We will keep you posted as that new website is up and rolling. You can read more about the coverage requirement and other ways to get more COVID tests into the hands of more people in the description below.